Hey, what's going on guys? This is Jubamis here and today we're gonna be taking a quick look at one of the finest Mac video converters out in the market that I have experienced till now. This is called the Mac X video converter available both for Mac and PC. So let's take a look at it. Also, this is the converter itself. At the front uh, time when you open this up, it greets you with a really simple and easy to use interface with um, mostly each and everything clear as it can be. We have the add file, we have YouTube, we have remove the file, we have clear and we have different kinds of options and profiles at the bottom. So we can go ahead and check out the options for now. So we have the profile settings so you can add and delete profiles if you want to and uh, you know you can have different kinds of options and change the profile in options uh, so you also have the you audio have language it, yeah. options and the target file name so you can add and delete the default file name that you would like to you know kind of add and you can also add different kind of options so this is pretty much uh, basic stuff so we can go ahead and check out the different options as well so here at the bottom we have different kinds of profile settings so as we can see we have the standard definition video we have apple devices and pretty much each and every kind of apple software too so we have apple tv we have idvd imovie and itunes as well so well uh we have uh, hd video we have uh, convert to mobile we have sony we have microsoft and even dvd so if you are converting a video file to edit and uh, transfer to a dvd to play into your dvd players you can also convert it to ntsc and pal formats so well this is pretty much about it you also have the music so if you want to extract music from a video file you can go ahead and do that as well we have also an option to choose the audio quality all up to 320 kilobits so this is pretty much the highest as we can go as far as mp3, MP3 is concerned and we also have the sample bit rate at uh, 44,000 48,000 so this is pretty much the highest that we can go also one thing that I noticed which was not found in any of the you know top of the line uh, video converters is that we can change the amount of uh, volume decibels so this was a uh, pretty much the most important feature that I used on these uh, converters as well I basically use handbrake as my default converter and I'm gonna be switching up to this one because this has this option and uh, what basically we're doing for an iDevice or a mobile device, the speakers are not that kind of uh, high quality speakers. So, you know, you might want to increase the volume up a bit so you can go ahead and listen to what you're actually playing on the device itself without wearing headphones or earphones. Well, this is pretty much uh, what we have to cover in the software itself. Let's go ahead and convert a video. I'm going to be converting to HD MOV and I'm going to be converting my introduction video. Uh, to test out so that is a six second video so we can go ahead and convert that it might not take a lot of options you can also uh, choose where to save the video I'm gonna be saving it uh, as probably on the default folder and go ahead and convert that up you can also as you can see here we can also choose the amount of CPU core uses so I'm on a Mac mini so I have two cores so you can go ahead and choose that up too so you so you can see here it is already converted as you can see the quality is astonishing it does not you know kind of uh, break out the quality or reduce it up this is total full 1080p quality so well this is uh, pretty much what about the converter itself you can go ahead and check out their website in the link below i'm gonna be giving this for a giveaway so you can go ahead and click the video right now or click on the you know giveaway page uh, below you can go ahead and check out my go video and uh, take part in that all you need to do is subscribe to me on this channel and uh, the rest of the instructions would be in the video itself so you can go ahead and check that out well thank you for watching the video you can go ahead and check these people out they have uh, some astonishing software out there so check out on the website on the link uh, on the screen right now on the description below you can also follow me at twitter at twitter.com slash mist and like my facebook page at facebook.com slash mist well if you're watching the video if you liked it do remember to subscribe to the channel by clicking the subscribe link above the video and until next time i will see you guys later peace